Well, hello. It's me again. It's been a while. Uh, Shirley was gone, and then I was gone, and now we're both back, and life in the office is getting back to normal. I, w I was on vacation with my family for two weeks. Uh, the first week was all rain, and the second week we were all sick. It was great. It was great. Uh, it wasn't our best vacation, but it was relaxing and energizing in its own way, you know, just being away from routine and all that and just relaxing. We had a we had a relaxing time, if not a the, the usual fun in the sun that we usually have, but it was still good. But it's good to be back. Um, attached to this email, you will see a link to the Lutheran Sentinel, uh, the August edition. And in that edition, I hope you click on it and check it out. There's lots of cool stuff in there. There's articles about the Apocrypha, which we just read the book of Judith on Tuesday Bible study. We finished that. Um, uh, there's a lot on Synod Convention, a lot of pictures. Take a look in there. You might see some people you know. Uh, there's a story about Lutheran schools, specifically our Lutheran school in Port St. Lucie, Florida, which is not far away. There's also an article about my great-grandfather, Bug Harstead. It's the 125th anniversary of when he went to Alaska to look for gold, to, to try to get uh, Pacific Lutheran University out of debt. He didn't go up there for himself. He went up there to, to pay the bills. Uh, he didn't find any gold, though. Very interesting story, though. There's also an article. There, there are some... some tidbits from the, the essay that was delivered during Synod Convention, and it's about walking circumspectly in the world. Circumspectly. Walking circumspectly. What does that mean? Circumspecto. Well, it's Latin, and I love it. Circum means around. Specto means to look or observe, and it's to look around you. When you're walking in this world, we aren't to have blinders on. We're to be looking around. Why? Well, I'm reminded of a hymn, and it's called I Walk in Danger All the Way, 836, from the New Blue Hymnal. The first verse is this. I walk in danger all the way. The thought shall never leave me. That Satan, who has marked his prey, is plotting to deceive me. This foe with hidden snares may seize me unawares. If e'er I fail to watch and pray, I walk in danger all the way. Uh, and that is a fact. Deliver us from evil. We say that in the Lord's Prayer, don't we? This world is filled with crazy, bad stuff, and there's evil all around. And I'm not trying to scare you. I'm just telling you the truth. Uh, you just turn on the news, for crying out loud. This is a wild place, and we need to be circumspect. We need to be always looking around, because the devil's out there. He's real. He doesn't have us. He's marked his prey. He's coming after us. But he won't get us as long as we keep our eyes fixed on Jesus, the author and perfecter of our faith, while we are walking in this world. I would like to read one more verse. It's verse 5 from this hymn, which is a great reminder. I walk with Jesus all the way. His guidance never fails me. Within his wounds I find a stay when Satan's power assails me, and by his footsteps led, my path I safely tread. No evil leads my soul astray. I walk with Jesus all the way. You got it. He's talking to you, the hymn writer, and me. We walk with Jesus in this world. And as we're walking with him, we're walking circumspectly. We're looking around us, looking for evil. Also, looking for opportunities to serve. God has said that he has prepared good works in advance for us to do. We need to have our eyes open. Can't have blinders on going through life. There's no cruise control. We're walking. Every day is different. Every moment is different. He has saved you for a purpose. To walk with him eternally, but until then, to walk with him now. And to love him and to love your neighbor. What a joyous task we have as we walk through this life, and what a joyous reunion we're going to have in heaven with our Savior when we will be with Him forever. No more being circumspect up there. 
just perfect, awesome freedom, joy, and bliss because of Jesus. Hey, have a great weekend, you guys. Take it easy. Bye-bye.